Welcome everybody. We're at the car wash today because I gotta do some washing to do this next pipification. Today, what I'm gonna try to do is smoke out all of the light bars. So all of the white LEDs, we gotta try to put black on them. Now before I do that, I have to clean them because there's bug guts and stuff, so I decided to come to the car wash because I need water and I can't get that in my apartment and I don't have a place to park this and work on it. So I'm gonna do it right here. So the first part of this video is gonna be me cleaning it. Then I'm gonna go back home and start cutting what I need to put on top of those. But right now, cleaning. So I've actually wanted to do this for a really long time. I just couldn't think of a good way to do it. I like black and I would have liked that these were black, but I just didn't know a way besides buying black light bars. They didn't make black light bars in this size, so I didn't bother with it. And uh, I had an idea for how I'm gonna make them black in a way that might look good and isn't permanent. Paper towels, rubbing alcohol to sanitize the stuff before I put the film on. This is glass cleaner, heavy duty glass cleaner that I honestly don't think I'll need, but I have it just in case. Windex, which is the main thing besides water. A nice soft scrub. Gloves for that uh, glass cleaner so it's not too abrasive. A towel and a rag. And I also bought this, uh, this attachment. I bought this to clean my motorcycle wheels with. I never used it. I don't think I'll need it. And I know this is way too rough, but in case I need it, so the first thing I'm going to do is go to each individual LED and give it a soft clean. That's just a nice cloth, probably some water and some wild soap to try to clean them off. If that doesn't work, I'll use glass cleaner and something more tough like that hard brush. And then I will take it all to the car wash to rinse it off with water. So after just one pass with a cold soapy rag, they all look a lot better. The ones up here, the big bars are the ones that were the worst and they actually look a lot better too. But I'm gonna be going over the rest of them, including my flashers, which are up there on the front. There's also flashers on the front here and on the back. I'm gonna do all of those. And then I'm actually gonna go over all these again with that strong glass cleaner because I wanna make sure they're extra clean. And then I'll go over them a third time later after the wash with rubbing alcohol to put the stuff on. But right now I'm gonna go ahead and wipe the rest of it down and I'm gonna wipe it all a second time. Everything's cleaned, I took measurements, and now I have to go home and cut the film. When I come back, a second wash, rubbing alcohol, and let me apply it. But right now, let's head back. All right, welcome to my workstation, where it's nice and quiet and there's no loud noises outside, but we'll get back to that. What I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna cut film. And while I do this, I'm gonna explain to you why I chose this. So, like I said, I thought about doing smoke before, um, but I was hesitant to because the only way I thought of was to like spray smoke. My two problems with that were one, if it looks terrible, it's permanent. That's the second problem, it's permanent. So if at any point I chose that I didn't like it, I'm screwed. I don't like permanent stuff, and of course I didn't know if I'd like the way it looked, but then I thought, wouldn't it be cool if you could just like stick a film on it? That's exactly what this is, so I just bought a roll. And what I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna cut film. So this film is an adhesive, so I can just stick the film on. Hopefully it looks awesome. Hopefully the lights still work really well. Worst case scenario, I hate it, I take it off. No problem. So, I took measurements, I wrote them down here, and I'm just gonna be sitting here trying to figure out the best way to cut these. I bought some little knives for this. This is a car I'm working on. My brother damaged it. Sad. But anyway, I'll be here doing this, and uh, let me get to cutting. Okay, 
they're all cut. It took me longer than I think it should have, although in my defense, it's my first time cutting anything. Some of those I'm sure are gonna be a really tight fit. Uh, in case they are, I'm gonna take the knife with me, but I'm gonna go back to the car wash where there is noise and get ready to put them on. I'm actually gonna start with one of these flashers because that way I can turn the light on and compare it to one without the smoke screen. So I wanna wipe one down, put it on, and see how it looks. So there's a difference, and uh, while I do like the brightness of how it originally is, I do like the way it looks when it's off. So I'm actually gonna step down here and turn it off and give it another glance. I love the way that looks. I think it looks a lot better. Now, I didn't do a great job putting it on, if you were to look closely, you'd see that I have like corners all loose because they're not perfect rectangles. They're kind of like, they have curvatures. And so it doesn't get on there exactly right, like on this you know, very top corner. But um, I think it looks cool. And the best part is, even though I didn't do a perfect job, it looks cool. And if I really hate it, I can easily redo any of them or just take them off. So now I'm gonna put one on the big bar and see how that looks. Dude. I like that. It's not perfect, like I did a crappy job once again. It's really hard to cut it exactly right because it's like a bubble here and then I had to cut it a little bit short to make it actually fit in there, but it's on there now. And I think it looks awesome. At the risk of blinding someone, I'm gonna try to turn on really quick. At a side, it's a lot less bright, but straight on, it's still plenty bright. And uh, I'm actually pretty happy with that. I don't think it looks bad, it doesn't look a lot darker. I like it sharp. I'm gonna do some more. Dudes, look at that swank. Swanky. 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 All the way around. It's so dark you can't even see it. Well, that's it. The lights are smoked. They're done. I'm really happy with how it turned out and the process. And uh, man, for the money, you know, 20 bucks for a roll. Very happy with it. So uh, this took me five hours. That counts driving back and forth. But I'm very happy with it. I had a good day doing this. Looks like it's holding up okay after the wash. But that is all for this Ruby Tuesday. Look forward to new ones and other ones coming up this winter, as well as whatever Wednesdays, go to Mondays, and find the Fridays. Thank you guys for watching. I really hope you enjoyed this video. I'll see you later. Bye.